a brand new home, could be your new house. Everything is complete, you've moved in. The contractor is left, only he's left one thing out, and that is he hasn't put a pipe under the sidewalk to carry the rain off the roof, out of the downspout, and out into the lawn. Now we could cut the concrete, put in a new pipe, and lay concrete over it, but there's an easier way. It's called hydraulic mining. We'll take this piece of PVC pipe, insert it under the sidewalk, and using a pressure washer, we'll wash the soil away and drive the pipe underneath the walk. When we're done, the walk will be intact, the pipe will be installed, and this water will go out into the yard over there. Our first step is to dig a pit on this side of the walk. Now, in order to drive my pipe under the sidewalk in a straight line with the downspout, I've had to widen and deepen the trench on this side. On the opposite side of the walk, I've dug a pit so that I have a target for my pipe. What I'm going to do is lay the pipe in the trench and force it under the sidewalk using hydraulic mining techniques. And I want it to go in a nice, neat, straight line with the downspout. The pipe's a little too long. It comes in 10 foot lengths, but I only need about four and a half feet, so I'm gonna saw a little off the end. I'm going to start the hole with a tile spade and then, being careful to line up my pipe with the downspout, I'm going to seat it firmly by using an old scrap of 2x4 and a hammer. And just tap it lightly to seat it. There. And now it's time to fire up the pressure washer. A pressure washer is not a tool that we all own. You can rent one at a local rental shop for $30 to $50 a day. It's a gas-operated pump. It greatly increases the pressure of the water coming out of your hose. While you've got it, you can wash your car or boat or even the siding on your home. Check with the rental guy. Make sure you know how to operate it and be cognizant of any safety features that may be important. And then we're ready to start it up. Now what we're going to do is blast the soil out with the pressure washer and then tap the pipe in a little bit. Wash the soil out, tap the pipe in a little further. You'll notice I'm working on the downhill side. There are two reasons for that. One is there's no room on the other side. But more important, I need the pipe to slope uphill away from the pressure washer so that the mud and water will wash back out of the pipe while I'm tapping it in. Well, it looks like we're through. A few final taps with the hammer to get just the right amount of pipe showing through on both ends. I've got a fitting that fits inside the white pipe and snaps onto the end of the drain tile. All we need to do now is seat them, maybe put a screw in there to hold it firmly. Hydraulic mining is a good way to get under a sidewalk if you've got to put in an irrigation system or perhaps electric wires for a lighting system. All that we have to do here is cover this up and we'll be ready for the next heavy rain.